And people were trying to figure out, you know, why is this the case? Why is this happening? Um, did the algorithm change again? Like, what's going on? Or is my channel just dying out and people just aren't interested anymore? Like, what actually is going on? But then I started to realize, like, wait a minute. YouTube Shorts is getting monetized in about two weeks or so. People who were getting a substantial reach and lots of views on their YouTube Shorts are no longer getting those. And again, their stuff is going from like 100,000 views to 10. Like, it's, it's that drastic of a difference. And again, I've experienced the same thing. And so I'm like, I wouldn't put it past YouTube to do this on purpose. Or to create some type of algorithm that makes it that much harder for your shorts to get viewed by people because they're now monetizing it. Hey everyone, it's Bieber. Welcome back to my channel. I'm back in another video. And I am here to talk about something that a lot of content creators have been seeing recently. Um, I know I've noticed it, but I recently went on Twitter, which, you know, I'm always on Twitter. And I've seen a lot of people speak about the same thing. So now I know that I'm not the only one and it's now becoming a widespread issue. So basically, as a lot of us know, even if you're not necessarily a content creator the big buzz recently with youtube is that uh youtube shorts are going to be monetized next month starting february 1st i believe and so of course um most people are really excited about this especially because um up until recently youtube shorts has performed really well for everyone um well for i can't speak for everyone but for the most part especially a lot of smaller content creators such as myself We've seen a lot of growth um, with YouTube Shorts and it has really helped to push, um, you know, our channel and even some of our long form content. And I know for me, you know, I started seeing a huge, huge spike in growth from YouTube Shorts. Um, I want to say around December, I believe, I started to notice that a lot of my shorts were getting like thousands of views at a time. And so when I heard that YouTube Shorts were going to be monetized, I was really excited about it because I'm like, if I can, you know, get that ad revenue from these shorts, I could actually make a decent income. Because for those of y'all who don't know, um, even though my YouTube channel is monetized and I do have ads on my videos, I don't make that much money. Um, I'm still, and this is why I say YouTube has to be a passion. Because if you're doing YouTube for the money, it's quick to lose that passion and not thrive for it because you really have to work towards actually having it be um a substantial amount of income or like even side income because right now <laughs> right now with my videos i'm making maybe i'm not even making a dollar on most of my videos i'm gonna be honest like even on my miel organics video um i forget how much money not, not how much money how many views I have on there so I have 330 views for context and the estimated revenue for the video is 19 cents um just to give you kind of like a realistic view of how much money I'm making it's honestly not that much and so but with YouTube shorts even though the revenue split is a little bit lower I'm like this could actually become like a side hustle for me if these YouTube shorts continue to perform well. Well, of course, um, you know, the algorithm, you know, was doing its thing. And I stopped receiving, um, you know, those views, even though I was using the same methods, the same hashtags, the same everything that worked before. It just stopped working all of a sudden. I'm like, okay, I guess I'm back to square one. And, and I really did just chalk it up to... Oh, the algorithm just changed because we're used to that. We're used to that on so many platforms, which again makes content creation so frustrating because it's like you can really find a formula that works and then within a couple of days it changes. You have to start from scratch. It, it, it's, it's infuriating, um, especially because it changes so quickly. And so at first I thought it was that, right? But then I want to say like last week there was... Um, a glitch that had happened um, that tanked everybody's views 
um like li literally everybody like even some of your biggest creators um a lot of their views got cut in half people were like what's going on so apparently youtube wasn't you know recording the views correctly and you know they had to fix it right but as we know when it comes to viewership and engagement a lot of those things it affects how your channel shows up in the algorithm and so if you're putting out content and youtube sees it as oh no one's watching your stuff they won't continue to push out your content as much which is why you see content creators say hey make sure you guys go ahead and like the video make sure you guys are commenting like that stuff actually does matter like how much you engage with a video when it first goes up it dictates how that algorithm pushes it out later on if no one interacts with your video when you first put it out youtube isn't gonna push it and then your video never gets seen and so it actually had a uh, long-term effects for a lot of creators even though youtube went back and fixed the view count but people also noticed and people started to bring up youtube shorts because people have been having issues with youtube shorts for a while where it was like every single video they were putting up and i'm just gonna make up a random number let's say they were putting up youtube shorts and they were averaging 50k right so 50,000 views on every single video but then all of a sudden they started getting like like insane numbers like 25 views or a hundred views or a thousand views and that's not to say that that's not a lot but just in comparison to what they were normally getting it was a very huge hit to their content and so but a lot of people were experiencing this again including myself a lot of my youtube shorts were consistently hitting the thousands and if you look at my YouTube shorts now, the views literally plummeted. Um, and it even took for me to kind of like try to delete and repost, which now I don't even want to do that. Um, because I've seen people say that their channels got taken down for deleting and reposting um, their own content, which is crazy. So I don't even want to like play with that anymore, to be honest. Um, but yeah, a lot of people started to notice that you know their shorts overall were not reaching and people were trying to figure out you know why is this the case why is this happening um did the algorithm change again like what's going on or is my channel just dying out and people just aren't interested anymore like what actually is going on so then i started to put two and two together i'm like a lot of creators just all of a sudden out the blue within the past like two weeks i want to say maybe even longer than that have experienced a huge tank in views and at first i thought it was like because it was the holiday season because i saw a lot of people saying that like you know views and even sponsorships and stuff like that all of that dies out during the holiday season and so by this point it should start to pick back up but it never picked back up but then i started to realize like wait a minute youtube shorts is getting monetized in about two weeks or so right People who were getting a substantial reach and lots of views on their YouTube shorts are no longer getting those. And again, their stuff is going from like 100,000 views to 10. Like it's it's that drastic of a difference. And again, I've experienced the same thing. And so I'm like, I wouldn't put it past YouTube to do this on purpose. Or to create some type of algorithm that makes it that much harder for your shorts to get viewed by people because they're now monetizing it. Because before, you weren't getting paid to do it. You were just doing it to reach a new audience, to maybe gain traction to your regular content. But you weren't getting paid for it. But I can imagine that now that money is involved, that now YouTube probably wants to make it harder for people to um, get monetized from their content which I think is really trash if they are doing that and that is my speculation and I know I'm not the only one that is speculating that that now with YouTube shorts getting monetized that they are going to push out YouTube shorts as much as they were it's not going to be as easy as it once was to get a lot of views which again really sucks because I was really looking forward to it even though I'm not a fan of short form content I've had um I I've pretty much been trying to experiment and play around with it because let's be honest we're, we're being forced we're like we're as as people who take content creation seriously and as someone that wants to grow their audience we're pretty much are getting forced into doing short form content whether it's youtube shorts uh tiktok or instagram reels and so i've been trying to branch out 
with the short form content, whether it's making my own original short form content or taking my long form content and, you know, breaking it down into clips and reposting it that way. And so, you know, even though I'm like, and eh, I don't really like doing the short form stuff, if this is going to work for me and this is going to generate results for me, then I'm excited to see where this goes and I'm excited to feel like I'm getting some type of payoff for my content because for a long time I just wasn't feeling that way because even with that too right like and again the proof is in the pudding up when I was working towards getting monetized I felt more rewarded for my content because it was like my content was taking off constantly like my my regular long form videos they were hitting like a thousand views like at least once a week and i i finally felt accomplished i felt like my content was finally paying off and people were really you know liking it and you know it was getting out there like i i felt good about you know my content because i'm like okay people are seeing it like it's doing good in the algorithm clearly i i figured it out like i, I know what to do now i know how to move forward once it felt like i figured out the formula and I figured out how to generate those views, which then led to me getting monetized. It seemed like as soon as my channel got monetized, the views dropped. The, the views dropped automatically. And I want to say, because let me, let me double check, because I don't want to say anything that is inaccurate. So I'm going to scroll down to, but anyway, I'm saying that to say, because I'm, I'm scrolling back like one month two months ago um but yeah like literally around the time that i had finally got monetized the views tanked the views tanked i literally haven't hit 1000 views on a video in a cool minute and that's not to say that it's for sure because youtube was doing that i mean it could just be bad luck um it could just be that you know, my videos just weren't hitting like that. Or maybe I wasn't, you know, make, like there's several different factors. Like maybe I just wasn't focusing on the right topics. But again, it felt like I had figured out a formula and I figured out a way to make content that is trendy, that is relevant, and that would be seen by a decent amount of people. Um, But for some reason, it's just like the views tink. So of course, as a content creator, I'm feeling defeated because I'm like, dang, I thought I had it figured out. My content was doing so well. So many people were seeing it. And now all of a sudden out the blue, now that I've hit this milestone, now people aren't seeing it. And now it feels the same way with YouTube shorts. I was feeling really good about it. Like almost every single short I was putting out was like doing really, really well. Um, and so I'm like, okay, great. And now it's about to be monetized. And so I could really make some type of income from doing YouTube shorts alone. And now here we are with the views tanking again on YouTube Shorts. And again, I'm not the only content creator that has noticed this or seen this. Literally what sparked this video is me seeing other people talk about it. And so, I don't know if YouTube is doing it on purpose. Wouldn't, wouldn't be surprised, you know, these corporations, they do stuff like this. Like, especially when there's money involved or when there's an opportunity to pay people more. They're going to do everything in their power to hinder that as much as possible and so i don't know it's really frustrating and i'm hoping that you know it is a temporary thing and i'm hoping that most of us who did see some type of growth from youtube shorts because i have to see that again because i don't know what's going on again i know there was an actual glitch that youtube did address and they claimed that they fixed it that was um you know cutting people's views in half or basically what the glitch did is that for several hours, it didn't record any views. And so it would say like, oh, in the past six hours, your videos generated zero views. And it did that across the board. And it affected a lot of people's channels because the algorithm looks at that and says, oh, no one, no one's watching your content. So we're not going to push it out. And so even though they went back and added those views um, back to the original count, it still overall affected people's channels. And so... I don't know. I'm I'm concerned. <laughs> I'm concerned that all of this stuff that's going on behind the scenes is low key on purpose. I hope not. Um, I hope that I'm wrong. I, I hope that I'm wrong. Like I said, I'm just I'm just making assumptions here. 
I'm just, you know, speculating. I'm not saying for sure if YouTube is doing this on purpose. But it's just, it's really unfortunate that people's content isn't being pushed the way that it should. And that it coincidentally is happening around the time that YouTube Shorts is going to be monetized. But yeah. Um, if you're a content creator and you're seeing this video, let me know if you guys have seen any changes in your content. Do you feel like your content hasn't been, you know, pushed recently? Does it seem kind of out the blue? Let me know what you guys' thoughts are in the comments down below. And if you guys enjoyed this video, make sure you guys go ahead and get a big thumbs up. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel. And I will see you guys in the next video. Um.